Hi, I'm Nick Cage, and this is Game in 60 Seconds. Today's game is Fallout 4. Okay, let's ride! Unlike Fallout 3, this game speaks through the introduction. No time for foreplay. The main goal of the game is to rescue your kidnapped son. There are also really cool side missions. Character leveling, monsters, loot for days, and a massive environment to explore. I'll rescue you on my own damn time, son! Bethesda needs to figure out a better inventory system. I ought to buy two pit boys and use them simultaneously just so I can put on my trench coat! I feel like freaking Neo in this thing. Whoa, deja vu. The inventory is good for saving your own ass. Whenever I'm about to take a final blow from a super mutant, I pop out my pit boy just so I can freeze time and evade the enemy. I got tired of my companion, Dog Meat, and downloaded a Jason Statham mod. He was the most badass companion I could ever ask for. Kill Statham! Kill them all! I'm gonna rip off your arms and use them to beat your asses. I hate how building settlements is so difficult. I ended up with a crooked upside down settlement. Oh, not there! Why you no know build straight? The loading screens take forever. Some of them are disguised as elevator rides. How tall is this building? For some reason, the button for melee and grenade throw are the same. Punch him! No, don't throw that! Oh, fire! One thing that really pisses me off is being desperate to pick up all the loot. Only to hit your weight limit and then not be able to run or fast travel. Coolest mod is the one that changes all the paintings to pictures of myself. Finally, I feel at home! Finally! Overall, I give Fallout 4 three big daddies, one grog, and half a Ghost Rider. You don't know me. If you don't click that subscribe button, you're about to.